What's up everybody? This is Jose from Sound Life. We are now on Rosecrans. We just turned off a of Western and we're gonna drive through Rosecrans at night. It's out 12 40 in the morning. Best time to be out here because there's no traffic. It's just uh have the whole place to ourselves. If you're not subscribed to our channel, we travel all over America and uh we're not, we don't go to Hollywood, we did for my wife to make her happy, but most of the time we just go to like normal places. We don't really just drive to go to the nice parts. But I'm trying to get a lot of diversity, so if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Check us out. We're always going somewhere interesting. If you don't have the curiosity to learn about new places, it's something wrong with you. We're going to be driving through Compton and East Compton and also Paramount. Sounds like a plan. On this drive. Yeah. Oh, man. And I'm not going to upload another night videos until we leave Los Angeles. Which is going to suck because I'm. This is our, this is our um, protocol with any, any city, city we go to. By the way. This yes. isn't just a Los Angeles. Yeah, we're not doing, we're not doing any, we're not pulling any special stunts for Los Angeles. This is our protocol for any large city. When we go to a large city, we don't... I, usually, when you're watching our YouTube channel... It's a few days behind, at least. Most of the time, you'll know... Depending... We're in Gardena. Yeah. You'll know... If we're in a nice, safe suburban area, mm -hmm. you'll usually know where we're at the same day. Yeah. But when we hit major cities, like, we'll backlog our day or two. Yeah. Just because you have to. Because we've already ran into experiences, like, in Birmingham, Alabama, Baton Rouge, Louisiana... Uh, and a few other places yeah, where we've we decided, just have, yeah. like when we do a a big city, we don't upload the video. We may not even be in the same state. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not that there are problems; it's just you avoid problems. Mm -hmm. you know? But in Vermont, mm -hmm. we're in Vermont. Okay. This guy's a Chrysler 300 right here. Mm -hmm. So, are you fulfilling your dreams here? <laughs> your dream is to go to Compton. Yeah, not at 2 in the morning. I wanted to ease up. To, I didn't want to <laughs> watch this car a little bit. It's a Chrysler 300. <laughs> Charger, Challenger, and Chrysler 300 make me nervous in any big city. <laughs> Same thing with Escalades and, and Yukons. Black Yukons make me nervous. He's gone. And he's stopping for a green light. Does that make any sense? Can find out on that. There's a green light. Oh, there's a hill up there. And we got another red light. We should have gone through that room. Oh, I even saw semi trucks. Here, wait. What? It says here, wait. On this thing. Let me just look at how far away from that. Wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that's a protocol for all large cities, really. Yeah. Like, unless it's like, even Miami. No, Miami, we, we live stream for Miami. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't say that's a protocol for Miami. I just don't like it when I... Well, I mean, meet. if we're in, like, Miami Gardens or... We'd live stream in Miami. Yeah, we do. I wouldn't live stream here. Yeah. No. You can live stream in Miami. We do it all the time. Yeah. We literally do it all. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold it, 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 hold it. We live stream from uh, Miami. Mm -hmm. Which, not a lot of cities that big, you're going to be able to live stream from safely. Not but we do time. it. Yeah, we live stream from Miami all the time, actually. Mm -hmm. um, even the uh, bigger, actually, bigger channels than us will live stream from Miami. I've seen, um, what's this guy from, uh, from New York? Action Kid? Action Kid live streams from New York and Miami. I wouldn't live stream here. Because for here, like, live streaming is like an offense or something. Yeah. Yeah, they take it personal, but. But in Miami, you can, li I've live streamed in Miami for hours. Never had a worry yeah. in the world. Um, Tampa. You know, I don't like live streaming in Tampa. 
I don't. I think we did we live stream in Tampa. You did once. You, and yeah, it was and it got weird. it got sketchy. Yeah. Yeah. It got sketchy. Every city's different. Tampa did get sketchy for that live stream. Yeah. It wasn't that. It was just that it, as soon as it got dark, like during the daytime, it was okay. As soon as it got dark, it felt sketchy, and I kind of cut it off. And overall, and this is what's weird about that. Yeah. Overall, Tampa's probably safer than Miami overall. Mm -hmm. But not the live stream. Yeah. What city is this? Broadway. You're on Rose Cranes. Yeah, I know Mars, right? mm -hmm. Um Jacksonville. Ho ho ho. Yeah, never live stream would I live stream. Not only Jacksonville, if I'm in Jacksonville, you'll never know. Yeah. Like, I know what places you can say you're in, what places you can say you're not. Like, if I'm in Houston, Houston's like a maybe. We still space out our videos, so you don't yeah. really see what... No, I I keep up like this road like yeah. San Diego like they knew we were in San yeah. Diego I was I was okay with that. Yeah. Um, this guy's driving around here in a smart car. That's messing up my hood vibes, man. It's just not cool, bro. It's like the least. You know what this person's ideology is behind this? This is the least offensive looking thing you can drive. If you're, you're in, in a, West Rancho Dominguez. You are not gangster if you're a smart car. Yeah. And this person's never going to have to worry about being confused for a gangster. <laughs> yeah. If you're in a smart car, you are never going to be confused. That might be why smart cars were invented because even You need to look like a square. You look like a square. You're to the point of where even the, like... Even if somebody had to pop you, if they caught you yeah. slipping in a, in, a, in a smart car, it wouldn't They're be... They're like, I don't want to have to deal with this I wouldn't want to tell my homies at store, like, hey, man, I rolled up on Jay. You found him? I found him. I found him, man. What was he in? Not, man, he was in a smart car. Same thing with the Prius. You're never going to hear about somebody losing their life in a Prius. I'm not in an accident. But not, not in the streets. Uh, you're, you're not going to hear somebody like, y'all, he was in a, I, I pulled up behind the, the gas station, he was in a smart car, bro. What do you do? I, I let him go, I'll catch him next time. <laughs> that just wasn't the way to do it. Yeah, I don't want to have to smart car, Smart cars are so uncool. Yeah. They're a crime, they're a crime preventative measure. Watch this car, it's just pulled. There's nothing in that parking lot. Yeah. Did it turn this way? There was a McDonald's. Okay, I don't like it. Then turn this way. Fall back. Right. Yeah, there, there's definitely a crime deterrent factor of, of a smart car. But if you want to be safe anywhere in America, hop in a smart car. Nobody's going to bother you. Prius, too. Prius is like uh, possibly. But the smart car will definitely be a crime oh, yeah. deterrent. I mean, that thing is like, if you drive that thing, you're definitely never going to get robbed. You might get made fun of, but you're not. You are picked on, but you're not gonna. You're not gonna. Your safety will never be in danger in this market. Yeah. Uh, there's no way you're gonna pull up in the hood in a smart car, and you're not gonna lose hood credibility on the spot. You could be the toughest guy in the neighborhood. If you pull up in a smart car, you immediately like lose two stars off your one level. Hey Jose. Mm -hmm. Are we close to CJ's house? Yes. Compton. You were in Compton. We're in Compton? Great. We're in Compton at night. <laughs> Not a soul out here. <laughs> this looks nicer than I thought it would. I know. Really like, is. I saw targets on the map. I'm yeah, like, yeah. how bad well, can it be? It's a target? changing. It's changing. Yeah. But no, don't get me wrong. This is like Miami Gardens. <laughs> you know what the perfect comparison is? Miami Gardens. Yeah. Miami Gardens looks nice. It's still super grimy. This is exactly like that. Because of the video game. No, it has nothing to do with the video game. That's why it's changing. No, it's changing because it used to be black and now it's Hispanic. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm. But not even that. They're just gentrifying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Look at Miami Gardens. Miami Gardens. You drive through Miami Gardens and you're like, oh, this is a great place. New buildings, new gas stations. 
Don't get it twisted. This they is call a, it the Ungardened. Yeah. yeah. And it's not from Miami. You're still in Compton. Don't, don't get it twisted. Yeah. You're still in Compton. Just figure that there was people outside in the other neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. This is kind of like cleared out. Yeah. Expect the lease. Okay, is there a bridge up ahead? I'm blind. Is there a bridge up here? What yeah. am I doing here? I'm blind. Go up ahead. I'm blind. Like, I can't see crap. Okay, there's a bridge. I'm blind. I'm dead serious. I can't see anything. <laughs> then we have a problem that we need to address. I keep yelling at you to get Jacksonville, glasses. Florida is one city. I honestly will say Jacksonville, driving through Jacksonville, Florida is dry, scarier than driving through here. Man, that Jacksonville, Florida is scary at night. Atlanta is scary at night. Yeah. And yes, I do bother him about getting glasses. Not gonna happen. <laughs> El Poblano? I bet you the Mexican food here has to be incredible. Oh, that place is open. What is it called? Tacos Mexico. Yeah, let's get out of here. It's not gonna be out here. It's open though. It's open. You can sit down in there? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I want... Jack and Box is also yeah, open. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's no, pretty I'm, much. I, I do want some tacos, but I'll, I'll hold off on the hunger until tomorrow. I really will. Yeah. Tomorrow I'll wake up nice and hungry in the morning. Mm -hmm. I can't believe you got me driving through Compton at 1 in the morning. This is insane. Well, you're staying where you wanted to be. Yeah, but not at 1 in the morning, Katie. Gosh. <laughs> Like I did not do this on purpose. I wanted to be out here at eight thirty nine, but Katie had her. She's I had. She was like, "You're taking me to Hollywood." I'm like, "I don't want to go to Hollywood. I want to go to Compton." Uh, it's like Peter Schnitzel. That's a beautiful thing about our marriage. Katie's like, "We're going to Hollywood to see a sign." I'm like, "No, nah, we're going to Compton." But like two totally different agendas here. <laughs> And we did both. Yeah. That's the beauty. And I complain about going to Hollywood. Deep, when I turn this camera on, she's going to be like, I can't believe you probably threw here at night. I'm scared. <laughs> she's not going to be happy, believe me. She's Actually, acting, I do not she, care. She holds her composure. This is a church chicken. This cannot be a good area. What is it? Oh, it's that burger place I saw earlier. This one's open. What is it? No, it, 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 it looks good, but not good enough to die over. Yeah. The parking lot's taped off. That's, uh, well, yeah, it's not going to happen there. Hmm. Well, you know, the good thing is they don't have homeless people here. Yeah. Uh, that automatically. Homeless, I don't know people like scared to be homeless out here. Uh -huh. I bet it would be scared to be homeless mm -hmm. out here. Skid Row didn't scare me. No. That, that, I thought Skid Row... The other thing people go, like... I'm sure if we started doing stupid stuff around here. I guess you gotta go to the hood to get you, good you can gas find prices. Look, look, man, the thing about this hood is like this, man. And this is true in Los Angeles, New York, yeah. Chicago, Miami, anywhere. Anywhere. I saw a $7, and I, $7 gas and it's four sixty dollars here. Yeah. Yeah. The thing about the hood is anywhere you go the same. If you mind your own business, don't look at people, don't just drive down the main road and stay out of people's way. You will n almost never have a problem. Unless you're in Baltimore, then the problems will find you. But that's yeah. a whole different ballgame. <laughs> Unless you're like in Baltimore, you won't have a problem. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. If you just mind your own business. Now, if we started driving around parking lots and. Going into side streets and stuff. Like we do with a lot of places. We do it in a lot of places. I'm not going to do it here. I'll give Los Angeles that much respect. I won't do it here. Yeah, churros. Who would buy a churro? What type of defiled person would buy a churro? This late at night. There has to be something wrong with you. Oh, they're packing up. Okay, we are, are in churros? East Compton. East Compton? Mm -hmm. They were packing up. Yeah. Hey, you do that. They didn't do this light, dude. I don't know if they have red light cameras on it, but I don't want to be stuck Probably. in the red light. Yeah. yeah. Okay, you're driving to East Compton and you're almost Paramount. Okay. Well, we'll stop it around Paramount. I think Paramount that way sounds like a little more suburban. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it's, if you just mind your own business, you're fine anywhere in America. I mean, you can go in some sketchy places, but if you just, in those sketchy places, mind your own business, you're fine. Mm -hmm. 
It's when you start doing stupid stuff, blasting loud music, uh, driving erratically, or acting tough will really do it. If you start acting like you're, if you carry yourself, like if we drove through here blasting music, uh, driving aggressively, I can guarantee you it would have not. It's just all about how you carry yourself, you know? Yeah. If you just mind your own business, you're good at anywhere. Mm -hmm. You know, respect goes a long way. If you, if I was driving through blasting music, driving erratically, I can guarantee you. What's going on there? Like people on the floor and stuff. Trees. Yeah. Trees. <laughs> it's a tree, Jose. I, I thought it was a little like a person. It's a tree. Gangster little tree. <laughs> All right, y'all. But well, there it is. That's uh, Rosecrans at night. Um, man, I'm sleepy and tired. Yeah, we're in Paramount right now. All right. That's uh, Rosecrans. Um. This reminds me a lot of Northwest Miami. Mm -hmm. It does. It really does. Is this like the Paramount where the movies? Or is that a different Paramount? I think so. Not sure. Yeah. I guess like Paramount likes movies. It looked crazy. Like if we were to keep driving on this street, it would eventually turn like suburb and stuff. Mm -hmm. You can actually tour the mo old movie houses. Yeah, no, it's touristy, and you hit touristy. But you can do that if you wanted to. I really don't want to do touristy crap on. I understand. Yeah, I want to feel like I want to go to the major. I want to see like East LA. I want to see South Central. Okay, baby. Downtown, yeah. Skid Row, the beaches, yeah. Venice. Like I want to feel like what the, the city's actually like. Yeah. I don't want us to just do touristy crap. We can, we, we, we did, we'll do a lot of touristy crap. Trust me. Yeah. And I guess we'll do Hollywood just to make you happy. just go to Hollywood and stuff like that. I, I can't do that. Mm -hmm. We'll do it, but it won't be like the focus of our, you know what I mean? Yeah. We'll do it. We'll drive around Beverly Hills. We'll do Los Angeles. All the, you know, somebody is burning a whole pan of that stuff here. I'll tell you what. What are you, burning garbage bags? Well, I don't smell that strong. I don't know if this area is sketchy. You know what's weird? As, as an outsider, I can't tell if this is sketchy or nice. I've had this problem a lot already. Maybe so you just like, Starbucks, I guess it's nicer. But yeah, I want to see the real Los Angeles. I, I don't want to be like, just doing tours. I'll go do some tours. Well. I, I, it's not like I'm going to come here and just not see like the real Los Angeles. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you, I was super intimidated because of all the things I've heard. It's been super intimidating driving through here tonight. Alright guys, we're out. I hope you guys like these drives of uh, the major roads of Los Angeles.